So it's Friday. What do we say on Friday? Thank like crunchy. It's Friday. Right, breakfast. So breakfast morning. We've got two wheat mix and some chopped banana. And I'm not sure what to do today, so I'm going to ponder while I eat my breakfast. Right, boring job. So my husband's gone to the dentist this morning, and I thought he was off for the rest of the day, but he's not. He's had a job coming. So we've actually got one more day of being alone. So obviously Ruby breaks up from school today, it's the last day at school and she's got two weeks off. Um, Ruby doesn't really like going to trash shops, she'll go, but she gets bored, she doesn't want to look at all the rails and stuff like I do. So because it's our last day, I'm thinking maybe we should go for a day charity shopping. That sounds like a very, very tempting idea. Here we are. <laughs> right, so. Lips the other day say is my favourite, Lisa Armstrong Clary Lipstick. I own about 20 of these, so hopefully I'll be able to wear them forever. Because <laughs> they've now gone down to like £3. I think they were about £9 or something when they first came out. So I think they're £3 or £3.50, so they're really, really cheap. They're just lovely. I love them so much. So it's actually a matte lipstick, and then over the top I put like a gloss. Um, which just gives it just a little bit of sheen and the, just the colour is just so nice. Anyone could wear this. It just, it would suit anyone. It's just lovely, it's a flattering colour. I've got my little necklace on. It says Janie on it. Uh, spark jumper that's very fluffy. Um, but it has these beautiful sparkly buttons on the shoulder. Um, and some little light jeans. I've not worn jeans for a few days, so it feels weird to be in jeans. My leggings were so stretchy that when you go back and put jeans on, it's like... <laughs> it's a good job I've not eaten junk all week. Right, so the time is 20 past nine. So if we're going to church shop, we really need to get going. Right, I think we're ready. So I've got on my little teddy coat, um, my little bag, jumper, like I already said, and my little Healy boots. Right, let's go. We've arrived. So I'm very interested to see how many coats we can buy today. So I think probably in the next few days, I'm going to like do a coat overhaul and maybe get rid of some and have a bit of a shuffle around and see what coats we actually have got at home. I remember I've got a bright yellow furry one that I forgot about and maybe some other random ones. So anyway, let's go for a lovely little quiet rummage and see if we can find another coat.
Yeah, you've got 28 days to refund, okay. Uh, keep the tag on and you've got 28 days. Right, we'll put that on there.
opportunities included. You're in balance. Don't want mess. You know what she is? You have to have a good look because you don't know what you might find. <laughs> I don't, they are and you don't want to miss anything. <laughs> We're back in the car ding ding it's just one o'clock i need to go in for my dinner i'm so hungry um so we've been here about three hours and we've bought, I've bought so much stuff it's just disgusting you're probably all thinking oh she's just an absolute shopping adult 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 addict i am <laughs> but i sort of think i've done such a lot of good for the charity shop so if I'd have gone to new shops, I'd have spent an absolute fortune. But obviously, I haven't spent that much because it's in charity shops and it's for a very good cause. And I like to have a move around, so I will clear out some bits to replace, you know, to what I've bought and stuff. So, yeah, it has been very, very, very interesting. I got so hot, like as you can see now, the sun has come out and it's really, really warm. I got so hot that when I was in one changing room, I said to the lady, can I just pay you for this top and keep it on because I don't want to put back put back on my Angora jumper because I will die <laughs> of heat. So she's like, yeah, of course you can. So I'm actually going home in a different jumper. Oh, so hot because I got like a thick thermal vest thing on and a fluffy alpaca jumper on with the one with the sparkly stones on the shoulder and it's so lovely but it is so thick and of course i've also got my thick teddy bear coat on and i was just too hot and i couldn't carry the coat because i thought i was already carrying everything else that i thought i just got myself into a hot mess oh <laughs> anyway so i've got a drink to have on the way home um, so it'll take me about, I don't know, about 30 or 40 minutes to get home um, Then we'll have some dinner and then I'll show you what we bought So I hope you've enjoyed it So I'm not going to carry on the vlog as such So what I'll do is show you what I've bought to get home and then I'll finish it But I hope you've enjoyed shopping with me Because it is, it is fun, it's very interesting what you can see And that vintage uh, Care Bear at the start was so sweet Some stuff was quite expensive um, And some stuff was just nice And yeah, but some stuff oh, That shell suit was like £40, I thought £40 for a vintage shell suit, that's so much money. Anyway, right, I'm waffling. Let's go home. Hello. Hello. <laughs> I'm home. Are you okay? You have to see me I'm just because I've brought a little bit of dinner. <laughs> I've missed you. Oh, you can spin around. You're so clever. Are you okay? You do make the funniest noises ever. I love you so much. Right, super 
first dinner and then we'll go and have a look at what we've bought. And of course, my little snoozers. Ta-da! Little snoozers. Enjoying life. Right, are you ready? What did we buy? So my jumper that I brought home with me, it's mine already. So loads of bits knitwear. Um, I'm gonna have a big shuffle about with stuff I've already got and have a swap about and stuff. So I've got this gorgeous H&M hoodie. So it is a knitted one though, not like a sweatshirty one. Um, and it's got like a little kangaroo pocket at the front. Really nice like blush sort of pinky colour. Um, and I thought it would be really nice, you know, if you sort of wear it and then you have the hood out and stuff. Um, I got this, which is a new look jumper. I know stripes are very big this year. I've seen them in a lot of my magazines. And I like the button details on both shoulders. I thought that was really nice. I got these strange trousers. These are ASOS trousers. So they're quite fitted around the waist. And then they've got buttons down the front i don't know if you can see this and then obviously like a bit of a flare split at the front so you can kind of have them undone wherever you want to so there was no changing room in there which really annoys me so i said to the man can i just try them on over my trousers he was like yeah so i tried them on in the shop over my jeans and they did fit so i'm sure they're going to be okay they're very very unusual but I love the colour and stuff and I thought, yeah, with a big chunky jumper and stuff, it'll work really nice, fingers crossed. I got this knitted hoodie, again, there was no changing rooms in there, but I thought, well, I'll take a chance. So it's a Primark one, but it's like really nice and sort of knitted. I think it's probably like a loungewear one. I like the big ties and again, I liked the hood. Nice sort of colour, like a greeny, minty sort of colour. I got this, I wasn't sure about this. Um, but actually, now I've got it home, it's quite nice actually. So it's just a, a denim jacket, but it's um, got a fluffy lining. So the sleeves aren't fluffy, but they are like quilted. Um, I got a bigger size than I would normally wear, but I thought it looked pretty cool as like an oversized jacket. Um, so obviously with like leggings and stuff, big boots and like a big chunky uh, polo neck or something, I thought it would look really cool. So again, it's only a Primark one, but I thought, you know, look, the roll up sleeves and that. And it was just so lovely. <laughs> um, and then I got uh, this shirt, which is um, a Marks and Spencer's one. Again, it's out bigger than I would normally wear, but I literally wanted it to wear underneath some of my jumpers and stuff. So I wanted like a longer white shirt. So it did hang a bit longer. Again, Oxfam, no changing rooms in there. How can you have no changing rooms? It's so frustrating. Um, so you have to kind of judge or if they've got a bit of a mirror, try something on over the top of what you're already wearing, but it's so difficult. Can't be having a proper changing room. And I got this. Dun, 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 dun. The lady in the shop said, Ooh, it's a bit dramatic. I said, yeah, I like a bit of dramatic. <laughs> it would do pound fifty. It was two pound fifty, and I thought, why am I even thinking about it for two pound fifty? Even if you only wear it once, I just think it's so cool. I don't know what I'm going to wear it with, but I will find the right outfit, and then it's just going to be lovely. <laughs> it's so pretty, but it actually doesn't weigh anything. It's really, really lightweight. Feels like it probably would snap if you pulled it, so I'm mean, gonna have to be careful with it. But look at the stone! That was worth two pound fifty just for it, for just for the stone. It's so so pretty. Um, so I thought, yeah, I'll find something to wear. With. <laughs> I was in the element. Right, I got my neighbour's paper. Um, I got Christmas mug. Dun, 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 dun. I'm going to save this for Christmas, but I just thought it was lovely. It says, Merry Christmas, you filthy animal, underneath. Didn't actually realise it said that underneath. Um, Santa baby, hurry down the chimney tonight. Tea gang, Santa's babe. Look. So sweet. So we'll save that on the run up to Christmas. I got this cute uh, shirt, but again, you could wear it open if you wanted to, or fastened up. It's like a shirt jacket-y sort of thing. And it's from... Um, Monkle, I think it's called. I really like that. It's got big pockets at the front. I got this super cute leopard print little top. 
which is a Marks and Spencers one. It's quite lightweight, but I thought it worked under all the blazers. You know, when I've tried it on, I thought, oh, that's so nice under the blazers and the jackets. And I thought it'd be lovely for layering. You could wear it underneath your cardigans and stuff. Fabulous. I got, I told you I bought a lot of stuff. I got this vintage wool jacket, which I really enjoy wearing my brown wool blazer. And this is again oversized, but it's a black blazer. So I thought, you know, for a change from a brown one, I can have a black one. And again, I tried it over my jumper and it fit really nice. I thought, yeah, it's lovely. Really like that. That was slightly more than I would like to have paid. It was £15, which I think was a bit expensive, really. But some of them are expensive there, but they have really nice things. I got this just because I thought it was funny what it says. Too much of a good thing can be wonderful. So it can be wonderful to have too many coats and everything else I have too much of. I just thought it was so funny. I couldn't resist that sign. Okay, are you ready? So I got, I'm trying to hurry up. This video is going to be far too long. I got this. It's bloody fabulous. Olivia, Oliver Bonus. Oliver Bonus. Amazing jumper. Zip up front, stripes. I know this is so, so trendy. I wanted to pee when I saw it. I was so excited. I was like, oh, that's just like the perfect jumper. I got this, which is absolutely gorgeous. It sits a bit sort of slouchy and nice. And what I also loved, I didn't realise at first, it's got gold stars on the sleeves, look, on your elbows. It's lovely. Can you understand now why I got so much stuff? Okay, and then I got this. That cotton jacket. Or coat, whatever you want to call it. So I think it kind of classes as a coat, but isn't it lovely? It's a Marks and Spencers one, and it's got like lower down pockets, but then it's also got these pockets here, which you actually can put your hands in. Um, I think it's made from wool, uh, Marks and Spencers, so it would have been new when it was expensive when it was new. It was nine pound, um, and I really liked it. I thought it was really really trendy, so it's quite nice to have one that's not long. Um, and it's thicker than a blazer and I just love like the tan colour. So nice, it's in really good condition. And that was everything I bought. Whew, I told you I bought a lot, it's so embarrassing. <laughs> so I hope you've enjoyed this. This video is probably gonna be so, so long. So I do apologize. So if you love charity shops as much as I do, then please subscribe to my channel. Come and find me on Instagram as Mrs. Crazy Bag Lady. My dogs have got Instagram, which is free fluffles. My website is down below and my little Avon shop is also down below. So I love you and leave you. I'll see you tomorrow. Take care, everybody. Bye.